Eyewitness News, call 12 for action. A Coventry mom looking to raise a few extra dollars found herself facing felony charges. And what happened to her could easily happen to anyone mistakenly caught up in a mystery shopping scheme. Despite not to go to prison, she called problem solver Susan Hogan for help. See how Susan was able to bail her out of this mystery madness. Shopping for a living, it sounds like a dream job, but for this Coventry woman, it was a nightmare that landed her in court. If you've ever thought of signing up for a mystery shopping opportunity, you need to hear this story. It's an eye-opener. The emails started coming fast and furious. They said they need a mystery shopper in my area for Western Union. Josette Cordoder from Coventry thought this would be an easy way to make a lot of cash fast. The emails promised lots of assignments. And what they do is they send you, they sent me the postal money order. They said use this much for um, the transfer, use this much uh, for the extra fees, and then the rest is yours as your payment. The mystery shopping company sent Josette her first money order for $850. She was to deposit it into her bank, withdraw the amount, go to a designated Western Union and transfer the money to a third party and keep $100 for herself. But skeptical this may be a mystery shopping scheme, Josette decided to let the check sit in her bank account for three days. When it appeared it had cleared, she withdrew the cash and started her first assignment. So I figured, okay, well, maybe it is legitimate because the bank cleared it. Two more assignments followed. Josette followed the same procedure, but the next time she showed up at her bank, she got the shock of her life. My account was flagged for a counterfeit. This single mom found herself facing three felony counts of passing counterfeit money orders. And there's more. Now they want me to pay it all back. And I mean, I believe it's like $3,200 that they want me to pay. And I mean, I'm currently unemployed single mother, it's really hard to get that money. It is a serious situation. State police say victims of mystery shopping schemes often find themselves facing serious consequences. A crime is being committed, and until investigators can figure out who has committed that crime, you may find yourself in that situation. Trying to clear her name, Josette called 12 for action. We contacted Western Union, and they promised to expedite their own investigation and give the court the documents they needed to drop the charges. Um, I was just frustrated with not getting the information that I've been needing because, I mean, this has been going on for so long. I've been missing out on so many job opportunities because I have these felonies pending. Well, Josette is no longer facing felony charges. Western Union came through with the documents and the judge dismissed her case just this week. Now, Western Union tells us it is working with authorities nationwide to crack down on schemes that use these wire transfers. I'm problem solver Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.